is what they do in all of the commercials that I sing. They go like this. guys welcome back to my channel i am that niger girl representing all the way on the east coast in the us of a guys check your subscribe button if you are not subscribed yet if your subscribe button is red and not gray it means you're not yet subscribed to my channel and you're missing out so please click that subscribe button and turn on your notifications so that you are notified when i post anyway let's get started into today today i'm so excited because Ooh. Okay, story time. I've been wanting to, for the longest, change my um, makeup brand. If you know me well, I don't really do makeup, honestly. Like, I feel like I started off with that big talk, but I actually don't do makeup that much. But sometimes I just want to feel good. And so I put on some, I mean, what's the most that I do? Foundation, eyeshadow. Yeah, I don't do a lot. But anyway, for years I've been a MAC girl and I feel like I wanted to, I just wanted to switch up change. I was looking for some, because my mom actually introduced me to MAC products and everything MAC. And I feel like it's time for me to move on. It's time for me to be a big girl and find my own product. And I've been sort of window shopping, trying to see what works, what doesn't work and all of that. And literally guys, this product they have been hunting me down like i open my facebook the ad is there go on instagram the ad is there like literally everywhere so um the product is called mented and i've literally just seen like uh i don't know i've been drawn to that product for some reason like I see all these models and stuff like i always feel like okay i can relate that person has my skin type and this is this you know so I've sort of been wanting to try that product. So anyway, guys, I finally ordered my um, Mented product. And guys, just for the record, this is not sponsored or anything. But um, I didn't get all the products because I wanted to try it out. I don't know my shade yet. Even though like on the website, they have a quiz that you could take to find your shade and whatnot. But I didn't do all of that. Instead, I ordered a sample and I also ordered like the foundation, the stick. And I also got the, what else did I get? The loose powder. So if it's a match, then I can go ahead and order the rest um, products like the concealer, primer, even though, honestly guys, like I said, I don't even know how to put on makeup. So anyway, we'll see how that works out. But I'm just excited because I got my mented. And here's the stick. You know, I'll be so surprised if I actually got the shade right because I literally saw one model that I thought like, hmm, her skin type is really close to mine. So I'm just gonna get the shade that she used and I'll see how it goes. But then I also just, just so that, I mean, if I got it wrong, I have the sample um, pack where they have, I think they have all of these different shades. So I could literally just pick my shade and see what works and I could reorder. But for now, I think that this is my shade. So guys, I'm excited to try it out. <laughs> Let's see. I've never been so excited about a product. This is what it looks like. It looks so fancy and I like it because it's, it's portable. Like I could just throw this in my bag and I'm out. But, um, Hmm, is that my shade? I don't know. Like, this is what they do in all of the commercials that I sing. They go like this. <gasps> Guys, it's a match! <sighs> okay, actually, I'm excited. I think it's a match. <laughs> so, I don't know. Oh, guys, I actually forgot to get my... I forgot my beauty blender. So, but guys, look. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Hopefully. I've never had a stick foundation before. Like I usually just have like the little, am I doing too much? I don't know. Guys, I told you I'm not a makeup person. So I don't know what's happening here. But um, we'll see. <laughs> mm. 
meant it if you're watching this. <laughs> you see what you made me do? I'm now like one of your commercials. The model that you use. <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking. I'm still trying to figure it out or think about it or I don't know. But I actually think that this is my shade. I actually think that I got my shade right. Guys, what do you think? I'm loving it guys <laughs> I told you I'm not a makeup person like all of this stuff is just too much <laughs> but I don't think this is bad at all if this actually is my shade I might go ahead and get the concealer the primer whatnot I'll be able to match my shade from there Okay, 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 okay. Okay. I like it because it's it's light, it's not too heavy. It's not heavy on the face at all. Kind of giving me the airbrush vibes. Okay, 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 okay. We can do this, we can do this, I think. Um, let me see what the loose powder is like. Guys, don't judge my stuff. I don't know if I even blend it correctly. I'm just testing this stuff to see if it's my shade. See, guys, I'm so good when it comes to just looking at something before trying it. Like, you know, literally just looking at it and trying to see if it will work. Like, I literally just saw that girl... And I said, I think she's my shade and it should work. And mind you guys, they had a whole bunch of models there, but I picked that one. Here's their loose powder. my foundation <laughs> mom I'm sorry I'm leaving you <laughs> I know she like we've been on Mac for years and I'm, I'm starting to feel so old I'm like there are new products out there there's Fenty Beauty there's, there's a whole lot of new products I should give it a try you know one thing about me guys I'm always I'm not an adventurous person <laughs> I'm I like to be comfortable. When I find something, I stick with it for a long time. Like, I'm not really big on adventures. Let's try this. Let's try that. Ooh, look at that. Mm -mm -mm, guys, I actually love this a lot. And see, guys, I'm not even doing anything like full on nothing, but I already feel really good anyway guys that was just oh that was me having a good time with this i'm excited to actually do some real makeup even though i don't do makeup i'm just gonna have to learn because all of this stuff can go to waste like that anyway guys that was my little makeup um what do i call that test but um i have a a challenge an accent challenge coming up and of course i'm gonna be with your favorite person my son kai and we're gonna be doing the accent challenge so don't go anywhere so guys we are back and we are back with another challenge and i have my son right here kai 
and we're going to be doing guys if you didn't see the other um video that i did with my son what was that challenge again um the pigeon english, the pigeon english challenge guys thank you so go back um a couple of videos and watch that video and today we're going to be doing the accent challenge and it's going to be the nigerian accents versus the american accents so we're just gonna randomly say words and or read up words and he's gonna say it the american way and i'm gonna say the nigerian way and yeah this should be fun but before we get started how are you feeling about this challenge great you feel great and what are you thinking about school guys tomorrow is his last day of school and this is not just the last day of school then we see you again this is his last day in that school in his current school so it's gonna be a big deal and how are you feeling about that um, you feel happy you feel sad what, what yeah, are you feeling i feel both you feel both yeah why you feel happy well because i'm happy to see my classmates and it's not free for the last time okay and why are you feeling sad <laughs> Because I'm leaving Chipman. Oh, <laughs> it'll be okay. You make new friends in your new school. You know, that's life. We move on, right? Right. And you're going to do big things. You're going to do great things. All right, guys, let's get into this challenge. Challenge number one. How do you say this word? Telephone. You say telephone? Yeah. Okay. In Nigeria, we say telephone. That all sounds the same. Yeah, I think so. So telephone, telephone. I think it's just the, <laughs> I don't know. What do you think? You think it sounds the same? Yeah. Okay. What's the second word? Umbrella. Umbrella. All sounds the same too. <laughs> okay. Calendar. Calendar. Hey, that's my husband. <laughs> Well, that's that's what Nigerians say. What do you mean? Uh, it, that one sounded different. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> What's the next one? Television. Television. <laughs> All sound the same. Okay. Oh, what's that word? Mathematics. Okay. Mathematics. Hey, that's not <laughs> how you say it. What do you? That's how Nigerians say it. Mathematics. And you know what's funny? Um, what's the short form? What do you say for for mathematics? What do you call it? The short form. What do you say? Like when I say what subjects? What subject um, do you like? How math. Do, yeah, you say math. In Nigeria, we say maths. Like we actually put an S, and I don't know where that came from, but we say maths. So yeah. What's the next one? Elephant. It's the same. Elephants. <laughs> sort of. Elephants. <laughs> wow. Okay, what about this one? C computer. Computer. <laughs> computer. Um, uh, that. <laughs> Do I sound like Peppa Pig to you? <laughs> yeah. Computer. Well, <laughs> we sound British, yeah, right? <laughs> All right. What's the next word? Dictionary. Dictionary. That pretty is similar. Pretty close. Yeah. Oh, what about this one? Crocodile. Crocodile. Uh. <laughs> Was that funny? Crocodile. Yeah. Oh, wait till we get to the tenth one. Tell me how you say that one. Hippopotamus. Say it again. Hippopotamus. Hippopotamus. Hey, that's <laughs> not how you say it. What do you mean? I tell you how you say it in Nigeria. <laughs> I feel, guys, I feel like that's the funniest one. <laughs> I don't know. And sometimes I, I mean, I don't believe it. I don't know. I don't remember myself actually saying that, Hippopotamus. But I know that's, that has to be how I said it growing up. Anyway, moving on. What's the next one? Water. Water. That sounds like pig too. That's what they say. Yeah. <laughs> what about this one? Pajamas. Pajamas. Hey, <laughs> sounds so similar. To okay, me. okay. Candle. 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 Say it again. Candle. Candle. So you, wait, you have it like the candle, and we say candle. 
Ooh, this one is another big one. Say that word. Schedule. Schedule. We say schedule. That's the British word. Schedule. Nigerians say schedule. <laughs> Was that surprising? Yeah. <laughs> what about the next one? Banana. Banana. Say yours again. Banana. Banana. <laughs> and guys, we're going to do the final one. The, the last, last word. One. What's the last word? What's the last word? Give Spaghetti. It to Say it again. Spaghetti. Spaghetti. <laughs> well, guys, that's all that we have. Huh? That sounds a thing, too. It does? Yeah. Well, you said spaghetti. I said spaghetti. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, guys, that's close. all that we have for this challenge. But, um, yeah. I'll pick up on this vlog tomorrow. It's pretty late and... This young man needs to go to bed because he has a big day tomorrow. And um, yeah, 